Snaps it. Jake Camarda holds it. This for a come from behind win for the Buccaneers. Operation perfect. And the Buccaneers with a Christmas gift to their fans. An overtime victory from down 10 with 10 minutes to go. And Tampa puts themselves in position to win the division next week with a victory. We saw it out of Aaron Rodgers earlier today. We see it out of Tom Brady tonight. These veteran quarterbacks, it is tough to knock them out of the box. It really is. It wasn't pretty. There was nothing great about that offensively. But there was a difference. When Tom Brady finally cracked the code, they got into the two-minute offense. They went to the hurry up. They slowed down that pass rush. There was just enough there to eke out the win. And the Arizona Cardinals lose for the seventh time in eight games. Gutsy effort tonight by the Cardinals. Their problem is gutsy efforts all night long, all season long, but it doesn't put any of those leaders on the board. How about that, Anjay? Yeah, I was waiting for that. And then these guys who know each other from their time as teammates in New England. Ryan suck up with the winner. Man once had the NFL record for the most consecutive makes inside of 50. He's so good on these type field goals and he nails the 40 yarder his fourth of the night as the Bucks score the last 13 points Tom Brady it looked like a massive struggle but they climb out of it to give themselves a chance to win the division next Sunday at home Trace McSorley's dream of beating Tom Brady his first career start comes up just short despite the efforts of J.J. Watt and the Cardinals who gave it their all on defense. They didn't play like a 4-10 and ten team on defense tonight. But Todd Bowles, Buccaneers are alive at 7.